<laughs> Greetings, fellow Ukers. I'm going to teach you a cool little trick to take fake solos if you haven't yet learned how to do real solos, like, you know, all that fancy stuff that people do with their left hands. I'm going to show you how to take a fake solo using just the skills of your right hand. That sounds cooler than it actually is, or sounds more advanced than it actually is. It sounds something like this. Can't you see? Can't you see? What that woman she been doing to me? Can't you see? Can't you see? What that woman she been doing to me? Okay, here comes the solo. progression is uh, on a slightly less well-known song than that um, uh, Thank You by Led Zeppelin and I did a video of that where I did a solo kind of like that I may do a separate tutorial of that because there's some other interesting stuff going on in Thank You um, there's a cool riff there but in any case that was a fake solo so all I was doing was arpeggiating on the chords in other words the entire song of Can't You See is the same chord pattern D through the whole song right and the solos are just two measures of that there's a bunch of them in the song and every time the solo comes up all I'm doing is just playing the chord on my left hand I'm not doing anything different with the left hand than what I'm doing all the way through the song but then I'm doing finger picking of the individual around with different rhythms and stuff on the right hand you could do just the standard for a while all I did was my standard finger picking pattern that was easier now I'm trying to make it sound cooler by doing variations on it and sometimes it doesn't work as well as just doing straight pattern but which you can learn from my other video if you're interested uh, but you can fake a solo this way and it sounds pretty cool I have fooled many far better musicians than myself. Some really amazing musicians have been wowed every time I take a solo like that. They're like, oh my gosh, you're taking a solo. And I go, I'm just arpeggiating. They don't know. They cannot tell. It is not. And then even when I say that, they're like, it sounded really cool. And it looks cool if you do it on a rock looking uke like this, you know, whatever. And you dance around and you look like you know, if you look like you know what you're doing, that goes a long way too. But anyway, that is a quick little technique for taking a fake solo when you don't know how to do real solos. If you know how to do real solos, do them, because that's cooler. <laughs> Someday I will come back and do a tutorial on that after I've learned it. But right now, this is what I do. And uh, it's kind of cool. Um, you know, I'm at that point where I play a lot with other people, and they will throw solos my way. They'll just be like, take a uke solo. And they don't care whether you know how to do it or not. So I do that, and they go, wow, that was great. <laughs> So there you have it. Handy dandy little technique. Have fun. Keep on you can you on.